I love watching Sid and uh, probably Datsuk would be the two that I'd say I watch the most. Some of the plays that Sid and Olvi make are, are second to none. Crosby, he amazes me, Sidney. Probably just the guy I like to watch most is Datsuk. I got two, Claude Giroux and Pavel Datsuk. Probably Datsuk, he's got the best hands I've ever seen. I gotta say Pavel Datsuk. Everybody, eh? I try to don't watch hockey, I don't know why. We have too many meetings, uh, it's enough. <laughs> Myself. Yourself? Yep. Okay. I would have to say Marion Gabrick. I'd say either uh, Grabner or uh, Gabrick. Gabrick or Grabner? I mean, I'm biased, but uh, definitely Michael Grabner. I mean, I see a game, the game, he has three, four breakaways a game, and you make it look easy like that, I think you're pretty, you're pretty quick. Me? <laughs> Crosby. You know, Dustin Bufflin is pretty tough. A big, big buff. <laughs> yeah. He's a heavy guy. You know, he's not easy to, to move. Chara. Tough to get to him. <laughs> ah, Crosby. For sure. You know the answer. <laughs> Might be Steve Ott now. He'll be, he'll be an opponent. I've seen his act up hand. I will admit it. It's my teammate, Steve Ott. Uh, just uh, Steve Ott doesn't ever stop talking, so he's probably got the best and the worst in the same game. So. <laughs> Whole entire Vancouver Canucks team. <laughs> uh, used to be Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh for sure was the worst. It used to be Pittsburgh's rink, but uh, now they've got one of the nicest. Probably Madison Square Garden. Long Island. Offhand, probably the Garden, the Rangers. MSG or the Island. I'm not sure. They're both pretty bad. <laughs> <laughs> MSG for sure. I forgot about that. The two rooms, not fun. At Boston. New York's better. I know it's two different rooms, but you have space. Boston, it's one room, and you're like, you might tie the other guy's skate. You're that close. <laughs> <laughs> my score. Got the puck on my stick. Yeah, fight. Kind of gets me going a little bit. Um, we score. Probably. You know, scoring overtime playoff goals, you know, those are the things that uh, even if you're not scoring to be a part of it, it's, uh, it's a great feeling. When you win. Just the willingness to sacrifice your, your body and mind come playoff time. Nobody misses a step. It's everybody's doing more work than they do during the regular season, uh, whatever it takes. Speed, speed at which things happen. The speed and what's on the line chills it makes you feel as a veteran guy like you're 18 again like you can't wait to play